Hello everybody, Richie here, Community Manager of NIMIC. I'm with Julian, Lead Designer of the team. Hi. This video is about uh, something that the community has been uh, eager to see, the Albatross demonet. It is the first glimpse of the Albatross consensus algorithm. Uh, it is a, a marketing tool after all, because we expect to, to create awareness about the NIMIC project in the crypto ecosystem and people should see it, how fast it is, and, and get like a nice first impression. So how did you go about that challenge? Yeah, I mean, so the, I mean, actually this is quite a technolo technological advancement, um, going like tr trying to, to build a consensus algorithm that is, that gets close to the theoretical maximum of um, proof of stake blockchains, right? Um, so. And still, of course, it's super complicated. It's a, it's like it's a, it's a highly technical topic, but still, we wanted to 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 build something that is uh, like to bring it in a form that you can actually feel it and um, see it, even as um, someone that's not that technical. So even if you don't understand what exactly is going on there, how exactly it works, you could still see what it means in the end, right? So and what it means. Basically, as is that we have a high, like we have like a lot of transactions per second, and we have a short confirmation time of less than a second, um, and we focus on those two, um, on those two uh, um, variables. Uh, let's say so. What we can see here is uh, a visualization of the blockchain. Actually, here the white boxes are actually the blocks. Um, Every 128 of those um, white ones called microblocks, you get a big one that kind of like ensures that the um, blockchain is still like is still in a good state, um, and then it goes on with another 128 blocks. Um, here down, you can you can see uh, you can see the stats basically, which means right now we have like um, theoretically 16,000 transactions per second. And here also we built in the functionality of sending test transaction that you can that you can also see getting in the blocks. It's quite fast, so it's uh, it's not visible for long. You can also just like press the enter key and uh, get a lot of transactions at once. Um, this still is uh, in development. Um, this was the first iteration. What we do right now is make it more apparent how many transactions actually there are. Make it more about the transactions and less about the blocks because the blocks in the end look all kind of the same. The main difference is how many transactions are in there. So uh, I can give you a sneak peek on the final version of this, which looks a bit like that in the end, and which just like accounts way more for like transactions getting into blocks. Um, one thing that on top we want to do is uh, if we have a lot of um, transactions, and I mean we can have like more than ten thousand theoretically, right? So we also want to show how it looks like if there are a lot of transactions. It can even even go to something mm -hmm. like this. And then I can see, okay, that there's a lot of transactions in one block and the, um, at the same time, this, blocks, this block takes less than a second. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, um, that's the idea behind that. Um, it's interesting how you kept, even with the transactions, you kept uh, the NIMIC visual identity with the colors, right? Because yeah. I can notice it's like the NIMIC, NIMIC green, the NIMIC blue, the NIMIC red. That's the idea, yeah. Mm -hmm. It cool. looks very cool because it, everything looks so coherent. Thanks, man. Um, yeah, that's exactly what we go for. <laughs> um, I don't know, what else can we say about that? Um, well, we, there is, um, if you go below, right, there's more technical information. There's more technical information, exactly. Everything a bit more explained. In the end, uh, we'll, of course, have some, some visuals there that you can see uh, over here. You know, so we'll explain a bit about the micro blocks, the macro blocks. Then we have a we have a special kind of block that always comes in if someone behaves badly in a way um, and kind of like takes care of that uh, that everything's all right again. Um, we we'll talk about the epoch, uh, which is uh, yeah here the thing that we can see at the bottom. Maybe one thing th that we can add here is uh, this is the actual. Very sorry, but I don't think you can say like behave badly and then mix it all right again. What? Okay. So th you're talking about the view changes, yeah. the orange ones. Is that not what happens? So this is either someone behaves badly or just doesn't answer anymore, like it's ah, like or it's offline. Okay. And then they, the other peers just go to the next one. 
Yeah, yeah this, okay. This, this takes a while. Okay, fine, right, because fine. Because they need to vote on it. Technical yeah. correction. Mm. The block doesn't. Yeah, okay. So. No, you're right. Okay, fair. Should we no, just I think start it again, fine. or should we? Let's continue. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Yeah. Um, so one thing that I wanted to add is, mm -hmm. I think I didn't say it yet. Um, what we see here is the actual blockchain. It's not a demo. It's not a mock-up. It's the actual blockchain that we can see here in action. I think that's pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Yep. And if you want to learn more about uh, Soren's correction, about the the, the behavior of view change, then we're also going to have a a link below about. Maybe that specific topic, Soren can write a little bit, uh, a, a thread in the forum, and it can explain it a little bit better for you. But we appreciate him joining us for a couple of seconds in this Thanks, video. Soren. Yeah, thank you, Soren. <laughs> and well, beside that, I, I think like, it's pretty cool the, that you can like really push that button, right? Yeah. How, how, how much transactions per second have you reached? Um, 80. Oh, no. I've I happen. I think I had 100 at some point. Yeah. But I, I think now. I yeah, know, the problem is that it's 50, too fast 50. For you. Yeah, I can't click fast enough. Right? Well, there yeah. was like 86. Yeah. 100. Yeah. Nice. Oh. Well, I, I, I really like it. So um, thanks a lot again for the for the explanation and the behind the scenes. If you want to comment something else about Albatros, or you have some questions, leave them below as always, and. Remember to subscribe so you don't miss any more of this, any of these videos uh, in this series of behind the scenes, the new Nimic apps. See you in the next one. Thank you for joining. Bye.